What is up everybody, this is Always back with another video on the channel. Today's video is going to be about an extension for Chrome browser. So let's say you are reading an article on a Wikipedia and that's a very long article and you want to capture that in JPEG file or PDF file in one file. The whole article should be in one file so you can read later on when you don't have an internet or you just want to save it or maybe you want to copy that to your mobile for later reading so I'm going to show you how to capture this I've been using this extension for a bit of time now and I really like it so that's why I just want to share that extension with you guys you probably don't know about it so that's why I'm making this short video so now the extension is far short so I have already installed that extension let me show you to install uh, this extension so to install that you need to go to Chrome Web Store the link for that is chrome.google.com slash web store even if you can search on Google as well which will give you the link now when you come to this page you need to search for far short and then the first extension you will see which says take web page screenshot entirely for short so you need to click on add to chrome i've already added that to chrome that is why i'm not seeing that add to chrome button as you can see i have that extension here now let's go to wikipedia and i'm going to click on that extension which gives me three options capture entire page capture visible part and capture selection so let's say you want to just capture this part of the page so you can click on capture selection and then select and drag your mouse whatever area you want to capture and then let the mouse button go and it's going to open a new tab which have your selected part captured so on the right we have two options save as image save as PDF now let's go back to Wikipedia and I want to capture this whole page so I will click on this extension and then I will click on capture entire page and it's gonna read through my page read through the Wikipedia page and capture the whole page and it will combine all the captures in one file so once it's done alright so capturing is done now it's gonna open a new tab and you can see here I can scroll through the page and on the right I have two options save as image save as PDF let's check out save as PDF so click on save as PDF which will give you this dialog box and you can browse to your computer and you can save this now with the picture if you click on save as image by default it's gonna let you save that capture in PNG file but if you wanna save that as JPEG then you need to go to settings for this uh, extension so click on that extension and then click on options and here you will see two options PNG JPEG so if you want to save that capture in PNG you can select that and come down here and then click on save and close now you can save this image by right clicking and then click on save image as as well and if you want to take that image to Photoshop or any other photo editing software so you can just right click and click on copy image and you can go to that software and then right click again and paste that so this is a really cool uh, extension I've been using it for some time now so I just want to share with you guys it's really good because I read a lot of articles so if you guys want to read a lot of articles and save them in PDF this is a really cool extension so that's it for this video guys thanks for watching and if you have any questions or if you want me to make any specific tutorials such as on Java tutorials, AutoCAD, Revit and I'm gonna start covering a web development tutorial soon as well so stay tuned and subscribe to the channel and I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Cheers!